All right, here's a good <coughs> question. I love this question. And there will be one like this on the, on the test. So they say the log base B of 5 is about that. And then 11 is that, and that is like that. But they don't know, they don't tell you what um, B is. I guess you could figure it out if you uh, did the change of base rule, or not change of base, but change it to exponential form and then do a same base kind of thing. But um, there's other ways to, to solve this question. And, uh, and that's how my lab showed. So given that stuff, you want to find this. So I want to find the log base B of 1 over 55. Now, I want to take 55 and express it as either a 5, an 11, or a 16, or a combination of all those. And you can see 5 times 11 is 55, so that's what I'll use. So, um, this is the same as log base B of 1 over 5 times 11. And I, I guess I could split it like that, but maybe uh, I could just use the quotient rule to begin with. So, I'd go log base B of 1 minus log base b of 55. I could do that same thing here too. So this is the same as log base b of 1 minus log base b of 5 times 11. <clears throat> Notice I put that in brackets there. And this is a multiplication. So that multiplication means it's the product rule. So this part here... I can do the product rule to that. So let's do that. So that's log base b of 5, whoops, base b of 5, plus the log base b of 11. Okay, and then I have this log base b of 1 right here. But then this minus sign uh, gives me problems because that negative has to apply to everything in this box. So really I should put a minus here and put brackets there. So this minus has to apply to this, and it has to apply to that. So I'm going to get log base b of 1 minus log base b of 5 minus log base b of 11. Then to finish it off, uh, log base b or log of any base of 1 is just 0. And then I uh, look up there, base b of 5 is 1.609 minus log base b of 11 is 2.3398. And then I just do that on my calculator. So it'll be negative uh, oh, 4. I don't know. You yeah, so do that on your calculator. Negative 3, maybe negative 4. Negative 4 point something. 0, 0, 7, uh, I don't know. Anyway, you, you can do that on the calculator. Anyway, that negative sign comes from log base b of 1 is 0, and then both of these things following that have to be negative. Hopefully that helps with that one.